by the time they visited Broomfield a fortnight later, the situation was quite different. A match of vital importance to Celtic, and he lost at Tynecastle last week, and then dropping a point against Motherwell at home on Wednesday. They simply can't afford to lose more run in the league race with Parks and Rangers opening up a gap at the top. And a victim of that performance against Motherwell is the Republic of Ireland goalkeeper Pat Bonner, who tried manager Liam Brady's patience once too often with a crucial error in midweek. So it's a first team debut for Gordon Marshall, signed from Falkirk in the close season for £275,000, and he follows his father's footsteps. His father played in goal for Celtic in the 60s. Good running by Coyne. This training. Stopped by Balfour and Dobchak comes in with that heavy tackle. Balfour having words with the referee. Celtic still in the attack with Cascarino. That's good play by Cascarino! Celtic take the lead! Well, and that was brilliant finishing by Cascarino. Giving him his third goal and Celtic colours. Well, they would be not too happy about this one. It all started because Andy Feltis had a foul for Dobchak tripping. Evan Balfour, Paul broke to the edge of the box to Cascarino, back to goal, two empty defenders behind him, holds him off, great strength and a terrific left foot shot. Well, Grant's header out, after his way by Craney, here's Cascarino. There's no offside, Coyne will be clear, he's got a chance to run it in goal, this could tie it up for Celtic. Some of the other defenders are looking across the lines, but in actual fact, Tommy Coyne timed his run absolutely perfectly here. Cascarina, the provider, and a terrific finish. Next day. In this break, it goes for Kenny. He's onside. A great chance for the third. A fine goal from Jerry Kenny. That settled it without question for Celtic. And well, it'll be created by McStay. We're to see this one again because I feel that Jerry Kenny might have been in an offside position here. Good finish, nevertheless. But the linesman bang in line with Craney. No, in actual fact, he's getting played onside by Chris Honor. And clinically finished. Jerry Craney capping a fine win, but points were dropped leading up to Christmas, 